Welcome to our tutorial about math members. In this tutorial, we're going to see examples of a few common mathematical functions that are members of the math class. We're going to learn more about classes later in this course on Visual Studio. First, let's take a look at my code here to see what's going on. Variable A stores the value passed from the text property of text box A. Next, the ABS function will accept this value as an argument. ABS is a function which returns the absolute value of an argument. It passes this value to the variable result. This will be passed to the text property of label 1. In order to see all members of the math class, I'll change this code as you see here. Math, period. To see what each of these functions does, simply click on the function. A pop-up will display information about the function. Let's tab and run our application. Let's enter an argument value of 10. Click. We get a return value of 10, the absolute value of 10, of course. If we enter a value of negative 10, we also get a return value of 10, and that is the absolute value of minus 10 also. Let's check out another function. This function returns the natural algorithm of a specified number. Let's run our application. We'll enter 1.3. The return value is the natural algorithm of this number. Our next function is the return value of a specified angle. This function accepts arguments in units called radians. 1 radian equals 180 over pi, or about 57.3 degrees. And let's run our application. Now let's use the tangent function to calculate the tangent of an argument. Run our application again. Let's enter 1.3 again. And here is our return value, the cotangent. Let's close our application and review the last function we'll be covering in this segment. This returns the square root of a specified number. Let's check out the square root of 8. If I enter minus 8, we get a return value of NAN, none, which stands for not a number. The square root of minus 8 doesn't exist, hence we end up with this response. In previous versions of Visual Basic, we would have gotten a runtime error in this situation. And this concludes our tutorial about math members.